this is a you you know celebrity kind of thing. I Prince Harry and Meghan Markle they bought a house in Portugal. And what I did see was that her American Riviera Orchard line is just hitting a wall in the patent department because of is it Harry and David has a line called Riviera not American Riviera something Riviera about their fruits you know and Harry and David have a lot of money that company so it would cost Meghan Markle and her um, I you know her business more than they had because it would be such a legal fight they couldn't fight it so I wanted to look to see if she was gonna abandon that I don't see her abandoning it completely I do see like something is like an offshoot she's gonna take some of the ideas and make them into another type of thing maybe it's the name change um, and she's gonna label it differently I do see like that's gonna happen um, somebody said that she was losing interest that was one of the reasons that um, it was she was leaving it behind but I wanted to check in to see if their relationship is still okay. Um, Harry's losing his uh, will. He still loves her. I see him looking at her when I get into his energy. I see him looking at her. He still loves her. But he's very frustrated. She's intense and he sees it now. He didn't used to see her as intense as he does now. He knew she had issues but he kind of thought ah, oh, all the good outweighs the bad but he he sees her now as very intense and difficult more difficult than he thought she would be not even just towards him but towards all their business plans and all the models and he's starting to go oh she said it would be like this and it's not like this so now he's starting to question everything she's ever said wondering how truthful she was I mean, he's been knowing this for many months, but it's really sinking in um, about the racist remarks from the family in England. I almost feel like, I mean, the house in Portugal is the cousin, Eugenie. Um, she is got a house there. And so his cousin and they're close, or they were close. Um, and I think her husband works for the company that builds those houses. Or So I think that's why he did that. And when I've watched that online, I thought, oh, he's closer to the UK, and it's a way for him to get closer to his father, and he wouldn't have to travel as far. Um, but when I think about it, when I put myself in his position there, he likes it. I see him looking at the ocean. And I see the breath, him breathing in this air. He really enjoys that, the different ocean. Because I know in California, he's, well, I don't know if they're right on the ocean, but he enjoys where he is in this Portugal. He's getting a different energy there. But I see she likes it too. She wants to be... Wait a minute. Actually, she's very resistant about going there because she's scared um, that it's closer to the UK and that he's going to pull something and make the kids go to the UK and without her permission or like go on a day trip and fly over. And she's scared of that because she won't go. Does Harry want to end the marriage? Ooh, he's thinking about it. He still loves her, but he's thinking about it because he knows something isn't right. But it's more of a practical thing. He's really concerned about practicalities. He doesn't want to lose his title or the money. And I know he just got his mother's money when he turned 40 but there's something about the title and the history and the being attached to the royal family that he's trying to hold on to which you know if, if he wants to more power to him um, 
and everything that they've been doing up until now, he's, it's been ruining that relationship. And I don't know why he doesn't see that. Um, I mean, as much as it is her fault, it's, it's his fault too, because he just kind of went along. She has him by his short hairs, as they say, pulling him along. Um, will he ever change his mind or finally see the being manipulated or will he see that he can apologize, you know, maybe go back or no, he, um, he wants to, but I see the two children near him and it's not yet. It's too difficult. And William is like mm -mm, hard edge in the past. I've seen him really looking up to Prince Philip. William did. And he thinks his father is kind of weak. In a lot of ways and so he looked to Prince Philip as a guiding uh, male role model in the past and so he's gonna emulate that and Prince Philip was never like Camilla he actually really loved Diana uh, but he also saw he was very rigid about certain things and, um, and I think William really takes to that I think he really thinks that's important in the future although you know William is a very modern person it's different mindset but I think he looks up to his grandfather a lot I mean his grandmother too but it's you know he's the male role model um, yeah it's it's in a weird place Megan and Harry are in a bad place right now they may put on a facade that they're okay I think he loves Megan she doesn't I don't think she loves him I'm gonna get in her energy she looks at him and his hair is all balding and his, if she found a rich man, and I said this before, she would totally leave him and then take the money and the kids, or not take the kids, but take alimony or take um, custody of the kids and part-time and really give Harry hell because she knows that's her only negotiating um, power. But it won't be for any time soon. I think she's too smart for that. She might have a outside situation there's the sun the hierophant which is government entities and the eight of swords yeah so <clears throat> the sun i'm seeing portugal and him enjoying that and the hierophant which is the institution royalty and the eight of swords losing sleep kind of hiding he's really uh, hiding his feelings maybe he's having a hard time but he made this bed didn't he <clears throat> Knight of Swords. He wants to fight. The Three of Cups. There will be something to celebrate. The Knight of Cups. So there will be something to celebrate after a, a period of um, difficulties. And things are going to speed up. So I think there's going to be something. A surprise that either he's working on behind the scenes that he will be relieved about because I was thinking about him more than her. He's going to be relieved about and it's going to make him quite happy and it's the next step of freedom in his life. Okay, I think that's it.